Hey guys, my name is Simplexive, and today I'm going to tell you who the most underrated character is in Apex Legends. The other day I was looking at some character tier lists, and honestly I was surprised. I noticed that one character was extremely underrated by literally every single tier list. This character was strangely always somewhere in the middle of the list, and it really goes to show just how underrated this character really is. Before we jump into the video, please be sure to like and subscribe as I make new videos every week. Also, be sure to stick around until the end as I'm doing an Xbox Game Pass giveaway. Alright, without further ado, let me tell you why Gibraltar is the most underrated character in Apex Legends. Holy shit, Gibraltar. <laughs> why does he look like a thumb, literally? Dude, they did him so dirty. What you say? I know what you guys are thinking. Simplexit. My guy. Like you can't be serious, can you? Gibraltar? Everyone knows he's slow and he has a huge frickin' hitbox. To that, I say this. Don't judge a book by its cover. The main reason Gibraltar is so underrated is because people's perception of his size and speed. This leads me to my first point. Base traits. Most people think that Gibraltar is slower than everyone else, mostly because it looks like that due to the animation of the hands while he runs. Different characters have different arm movement speeds, but a quick Google search reveals that each of the eight legends in Apex Legends share the same run speed. Then it goes on to say that characters look faster and slower than one another thanks to the hand and arm animation speeds. So not only is Gibraltar the same speed as every other legend, but he actually takes less damage than most other legends. All damage he takes is reduced by 15% and he is immune to slow effects from weapon fire. This is all possible through one of his passive abilities, Fortified. Fortified is used to make up for his larger hitbox and it makes the net amount of damage he takes more or less equal to someone like Wraith or Pathfinder. On to his abilities now. Abilities. This is the category where Gibraltar really shines. His passive ability, Gun Shield, is literally the most useful thing. It essentially gives you 75 more shield than anyone else and gives you an automatic advantage in any gunfight. In the time it takes you to pop someone's body shield, they will have just finished popping your gun shield. And who wins the fight in that situation? You do. This ability also gives you the upper hand in almost any 1v1 fight. Make sure to only have the shield up in active combat though because it can give your position away otherwise. Really, the only con to this ability is that it leaves your back vulnerable, so be sure to watch out for any flanking characters. Gibraltar's tactical ability, Dome of Protection, is a large domed shield that protects everyone inside from all damage from outside the dome. This ability not only protects you from all damage, but all consumables used are consumed 25% faster. This makes it great for throwing down the shield when your HP is running low so you can heal faster than you usually could. The dome can also be used to defend a care package, block off an entrance, or fake your enemies out. There really are endless possibilities. But again, be sure to use it carefully because it can give away your position easily. Gibraltar's ultimate ability, Defensive Bombardment, really is exactly what the name describes. It's best used as Defensive Bombardment. You can call it inside your own dome shield to give you a few seconds of rest as enemies will be unable to come inside. You can use this time to revive, heal, reload, or run away. It can also be used defensively to drive enemies out of cover, but be careful because it can do damage to you as well as them. One important thing to note is that his ultimate not only affects you, but it can also affect your enemies. Uh, your teammates are luckily immune to its effects though, so just keep that in mind as you play with him. Gibraltar's abilities combine support, defense, and offense into one when used correctly, something that is mostly unique to him. They can be used in almost any situation and that makes them very adaptable and useful for pretty much any team. Not only this, but he is both a team player as well as a strong solo character. His larger hitbox is made up for by his two passive abilities, and he is just as fast as any other character. He provides defense for his team as well as a strong offense. Plus, his abilities are straightforward and he is super easy for new players to pick up. All of this has led me to believe that Gibraltar is the most underrated legend in Apex Legends. Thanks everyone for watching. 
If you've made it this far, here's what you need to do to enter in the Xbox Game Pass giveaway. There's only three things you need to do to enter. Number one, comment on the video who your favorite character is in Apex Legends. Number two, like the video. And number three, subscribe to my channel. Do those three things and you're in. And if you want to get a second bonus entry into the drawing and double your chances of winning, all you gotta do is follow my Instagram linked in the description of the video. With that, uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, please consider giving me a like and be sure to subscribe as I post new videos every single week. I'll see you guys in the next one.